Oh boy. Whew. Boy howdy. Yo, anyway, good morning, afternoon, evening. I don't know why Discord is fucking up. Hold on. Um <laughs> Okay, so here, Discord. Okay, there we go. Now it's showing. Yeah, there's. Uh, I might have to actually keep my YouTube window up because uh, it's not letting me do like anything. And I guess also Discord has to be pinned too. But yo, good morning. Oh, hold that. Just got fucked up. I literally just went to move this. My bad. Sorry about that, everyone. Uh, but good morning, afternoon, evening. I hope everyone is having a wonderful Saturday and a good weekend so far. Hello there, Pangy Swanee. Soul, hey, how's it going? And also, Alex, thank you for doing that. Um, how's everyone doing today? Hopefully, well. Um, so hold on, I gotta ping for something. What? Who's pinging me? Ew. People talking to me? Ew, disgusting. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, Hopefully everyone's doing well. Uh, we are actually back with the first Minecast in also Kiwi. Hey, how's it going? Hello, hello. Um, we are back with the first Minecast in a long time. Um, it's been like maybe a month almost since the last one we had. Uh, but if you'd like to watch us both at the same time, exclamation mark multi in the chat. To watch both Riker and I. Uh, speaking of, I should probably like undefin myself. I think he's like in the midst of his intro right now. So we'll let's let's tune in and find out what they're uh, discussing, shall we? Or Discord's just not going to let me use. Oh, fuck. My num lock off? Hold on. No, it's on. Which I don't know if this Thursday we will be doing it because I think I have something planned for that Thursday. But, uh, no, I think I still will do something. But, like, essentially what I was thinking of was, like, if I don't do something that Thursday, what will end up happening, if I don't do Octopath, I will be doing Metroid Prime. Maybe. I, I'm debating if I want to start Metro Prime because it is a shorter game, so I was like, I don't feel... But I wanted to put it on the retro one, but I was just like, again, it would be, Do like, it, really no balls. problematic. So I guess we'll just see when we get there, but I'll let you know, like, there will be some game to supplement out about that we don't get to that point in the game. Oh, hi, how's it going? Hey, gamer, how's it going? Pretty solid, pretty spiffy. So did you want to get into the conversation that we were doing that you wanted to hold out on? Oh, yeah, because we were just talking a bunch uh, before stream. Um, tired? Yo, I get that, Kiwi, same. This weather change has me fucked up like no, uh, like no tomorrow. Uh, Absolutely, I agree. Yeah. Um, so yeah, what were we actually talking about, uh, before we started? Um, it was, like, specifically with the Popey Mans, and then there was the rumors that were coming out, the rumor mill. I like spring, I like rain. I like spring and rain too, Soul, but also, uh, I don't enjoy when the weather jumps, like, 25 degrees between days. Uh, like it does here in Magical Cornland. Um, oh yeah, the Pokemon announcement stuff. Um, yeah, we're gonna discuss that real quick. The Pokemon Direct was recent. Um, I didn't get to see it, see it, but I saw the live tweets from Serebii. You do not need napkins. Those are mine. Sorry. <laughs> Excitebike is, like, out here just trying to get his gremlin little hands on anything that I, he can, and I don't know why. What is that? Chopper face! I love that, Alex! Bruh. Can we get much higher? Watch the direct on oh, stream? Hi. Uh, maybe? Could, I guess. I don't know. Like, I just saw the recaps of it. Uh, especially when the real wheel drive is involved. It can be funky sometimes. Seeing isn't enough. Funky. Funky There's monkey. More. I don't know. Do you want us to live react to it, Riker? Like, I don't know how long the direct was. Because we only it's got, like... like 20 minutes? Uh, do you want to live watch it again? Sure, I don't mind doing it. I like, it. if that's the. I, I think what we could do is. um, I don't mind skipping over the whole. Because there's a lot of talk about Pokemon Sleep, and it just kind of gets a little, like, into the, all the details and the nitty gritty. And yeah. I don't. Like, it, it's just too much. I'm just like, eh, I, we could just probably skip that. That's up to you, though, if you want to watch the whole thing. Might as well watch it. We can just talk over the parts that start to get a little boring. All right. All right. So cool. Let me get. And this then after that, we can talk up. about the rumors that were coming out. Oh well. yeah, the the rumors. The yeah, the rumors and and. I'll we'll get into it. And like, there's a bunch of other things, and people are like, ah, it's so bad. It's so rampant. So it's. 
hold on. Let me find the full video. Here it is. It's yeah, a I got it from the video. official Pokemon channel. Okay. Got this pause. Let me get this cropped out. We're gonna get rid of. We're not gonna have friggin' uh, chat replay on. Let me pause my music. Which, by the way, that is dedicated to Moonlight from Final Fantasy XIV OST. The Final Fantasy XIV, holy crap. Yeah, which actually is on sale. If you guys want another MMO addiction, I do recommend it. And I'm not just saying that because it's a game I enjoy. And maybe we'll uh, stream wing, it wing, tomorrow. Nudge, nudge, I don't you know. know. Like, it's I don't know what we're going to do tomorrow. There's no way I'm missing it. I watched it at school, lol. That's fair. I didn't. I. It was, uh... <laughs> Okay, just that chopper face alone is a great face, and then just to see it with whatever those are, I just it, it, chef's kiss. Great, great job, Alex. Chef's kiss you, all the way. Alex, you did not fail the assignment. Oh, right. the, the the Mr. Hyena boy. Oh God, did he did he stab me again? Oh yeah, that was the first thing he did coming in. It was hilarious. God damn it! Like Riker is not Robert. even in this chat, and Alex makes it his mission to. Uh, I should actually do this on my other one. Hold on. We're gonna Bro, we're gonna swap scenes even, here in I'm the not studio in real that quick. chat right now, and this man will. There's been times that this man has like said, "Oh yeah, I stabbed you." I was like, "What the fuck? I'm not even there at the moment." Okay, I'm just literally but like, like doing something else. To be fair, it is aha funny. Bruh, it's this, a, this is it's a this little hee hee. It's targeted, man. It's a little hee hee, if you will. Drop on this. Let me know when you're ready. Uh, so I can hit mine. Uh, cause I have not done a video share in a while. Video share, holy shit. I Wait, know, are we right? sharing it? Do you want me to share it via, like, screen share on Discord? No, or, like, no, no, cause that's a, fuck, that's a pain in the ass to set up on my side. <laughs> no, I got it, I got it on mine, it's just more like, I've, I've not showed a, a YouTube video on stream in quite some time, so my crop pad is funky wonky. The funky monkey. The funky, funky monkey. The funky monkey. Yeah, I almost forgot that song. Good. Yeah. I also just realized that my cropping skills are not great when it comes to this because I just realized the video's title kind of slightly cropped out, but eh, it's fine. It's it, okay. Okay, it good. <laughs> Listen, dude, I set this up ages ago and I was just like, oh, yeah, I really need to fix it. <gasps> I need to fix it at some point or another. Just get good. Like, be like me. Just get good. Oh, uh, really? Really, yeah. bro? You really want to say that? After the, the, the atrocities that I witnessed you trying to open up this OBS? Yeah, okay, well, OBS just needed to update. Also, uh... <sighs> Alex, I thought you in I thought you liked me. Why are you doing this to Yay! me? Yay! Why, 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 Alex? I thought we were, I thought we were cool. I thought our... I thought the haha -ha funny of just you coming in and stabbing Riker when he's not even here was enough to cement uh, our kinship. Why are you doing this to me? How it's fucking karma. dare you make me become yeah. the circus? Yeah. I don't remember yeah. Brass Monkey either. Why don't I put the question mark? I'm extremely dumb. Alex, just, Alex, just, just, just wait for the next time you stream because uh, I know you got some, you got some redeems on your side. Just, just you wait, just you wait. Oh no, yeah, hell hath no fury in the name of scorn. I, the nose isn't for you, Coco. Oh, the nose isn't for me. It's for Reich. Oh, um, that means I have to manually put one on him. Um, oh. I right, well, never mind, Alex. I take back my threats that I just made. We cool, we cool, we cool. Uh, Wait, what did you do? He, the nose isn't for me. It's for you. I have to put a clown nose on you. Wait, why? What did I? Wait, what? <laughs> That's what Alex redeemed it for. Not for clown nose, not for me, but for you, apparently. What the? F why? <laughs> I don't know. We're not even in the same instance. No, we're not. But, uh, you know, that's not going to stop me from just uh, putting a clown nose on you. Bro. Alright. Image. Uh, I'm shaking my head. In Name is already in use. Wait, do I already have a clown nose thing already? Oh my gosh, I, I do. Oh, it must have been from before I put it in VTube Studio. Oh, it might have been from uh, the times I've had to have it on my... um model when vtube studio just looks at me and says no i no 
Not today, son. Not today. Alright. This might not be the best because of the fact that Riker will move the time. But there we go. Yeah. I I I hope this is what you uh you wanted, Alex. <laughs> I hope this is what you came for. I forgot I still have twenty five K to work with. You know, uh what what does this do? I hope you're not doing what I think you're doing right now, so I really hope not. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so watch the world burn means that the shank command is turned off for five minutes. And Bro, we haven't even started the video. <laughs> yeah, we haven't even started the video, and people are about to get. At least it's ever, it's just chaos is ruled supreme. Now, if you would like me to uh, refund those uh, soul, I can. Um, <laughs> just because it does take a sec for me to set up the command and everything, and then we have to set the timer and blah blah blah, and I have to put up the text saying, oh yeah, this is on, so don't get mad at me if you get timed out. It's not my fault. I honestly do not care. And you know, we haven't done it in a while. Um, Hold on, let me find the text. Yeah, we'll watch the video eventually, guys. Don't worry. Um, Eventually we will. There's a shank warning text. I, yeah, it's not on the All right, cool. Alright, so... <laughs> I just look over and the cloud nose is completely off your face because it's towards your head. It's like, ah, uh, trying to get it to like somewhat stay on. You know, there we go. It's just yeah. right there. Bro, it's just like it's I, rough out here, man. It's so, just like trying to figure everything out. If you guys don't want to be shanked uh, before the command cooldown is turned off, say something now in chat. And also, if you end up shanking someone who's made it clear they don't want to be shanked, you'll be timed out for like 30 minutes. So, yeah, bitch cannon will. Uh, um, a motherfucking cannon will, damn. I respect it. All right, you know, we this is how we do it here, buttery cocoa stream. That where I allow my users oh, to sh where I allow my users to sh each other randomly. Yeah, I know. Right? It literally makes the purge every other side. It's like, yeah, all right, purge yeah. time, let's do it. Yeah, honestly. All right, so is anyone saying they don't want it? In my defense, I'm Shweeby. Riker Square. Yo, Soggy and Mochi both. How's it going, gamers? Wow, the two. I would like to revoke the, the right to duo. shake myself. Okay, we'll see. I had no idea what I was doing in my defense. I, um, burn, burn, burn. Yeah, okay, so I think everyone's good for it. Um, so, yeah, I'm gonna go turn this off, and we'll pray that bot works, and, uh, yeah. Save that. Saved. Hey, Siri. Hey Siri, hmm? set an alarm for five minutes from now. Oh Don't. no. Alright, cool. Command should be up and good. You guys start shanking each other. Have fun. Um, I right, say so yeah. While well, that's uh going on, let's uh let's watch this uh Pokemon Presents video, shall we? Alright. We'll, we'll also just I'm gonna casually ignore the dumpster fire. Alright, so let me know when you're ready to start it. Riker? Mm -hmm. I, I, I said, let me know when you're ready to start. Oh, I'm ready. Oh, I'm ready to go. I was just like waiting for you at this point. I was just like, yeah, no, yeah, no. I, I, yeah, I said, yeah, let me know when you're ready to start because I was getting ready. Oh, like, okay, I thought I'm we were going to do like the. Uh, yeah, I thought we were going to do like out. the. I kind of just went. Uh... Yeah, no, it's all good. Anyway, uh, all right, let's do this. Three, two, two one. One. Go. Go. It's the Pikachu! What is that? Oh my it's gosh! Like an it's like an animatronic, what am I watching? I like that. Today, February 27th, is Pokemon Day. Woo! This is the date that the Has it really been that long? Pokemon Green game yep. was first released in Japan, marking the beginning of the Pokemon series. At the time, only 151 Pokemon had been discovered. But now that number Yep, has it's been that long. I can't believe 1, it. 000. That was four days to ago. All you trainers oh, yeah. around the world who have journeyed together with your Pokemon over the years, we are so thankful for your support. In today's presentation, we will be bringing you all sorts of news about Pokemon. First, we would like to talk about this year's Pokemon World Championships, the first ever to be held in Japan. Oh, this I didn't know that. Round, take it away. 
Oh my gosh, the Pikachu thing fucking moves. It, I love it. It, it really does. Oh, it's it's crazy, bro. It's wild. I'm Chris Brown from the Pokemon Company International. I love it. And I'm so glad to join you again to talk about oh, our yeah, the championship. Pokemon World Championships. You know, I've always wanted to go this to one, year, but I never yeah. had the chance. I was also just shit at Pokemon. I'm like, now I'm too old, and I'm like, nah, man. To yeah. yeah. Pokemon and experience too late for me. Thank you Sight, to all please. the trainers who made the London World Championships our largest ever, and congratulations again to our newest world champion. Now I'd like to share with you all 2023 World Championship. Is it Wolfie Glick still the champion? Pokemon World Championship I think so. Held in Japan I just got my ears destroyed by TF2. Nice. We look forward to training Hell yeah. The Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games. Wait, the Pokemon Go has a championship? Games, Pokemon Go. What? Pokemon Unite. What? August 11th to 13th at the <laughs> I didn't, wait, hold on a minute. <laughs> For more than a decade. <laughs> Pokemon Go has a championship. Let's go. What the hell? I know Today, Unite, and I know I'm the other ones. That makes sense to me. But Go? For the very first Those time. logos were pretty cute. Let's have a look. They are nice logos. Let me see what the Japan one is. I'm curious. The the creation of Pokemon, the original. Oh. Yo, Pikachu with the ramen, and also uh, Point Coco with the it. rice balls and the sushi the roll. That's cute. So special. I like that. Our community. Man, I mean, this would be my excuse to go to Pokemon. It's just for this. Pokemon. To go to, my bad, to Pokemon to, to Japan, it. sorry. Oh yeah, the I'm competitive dumb. scene in Go is crazy. Hey yo. What? Apparently. I can't believe Thank that. You. What? Thank you, Mr. I, I thought that game like just had like a, oh, you know, a hardcore community. I didn't think a competitive scene does shit. Yo, year. that old man who has like the 20 billion Go phones, he, on, yeah, he was onto something. Have a look at this video. <laughs> I like the Pikachu. What is this? What? What is? What? Pokemon trade? What? Why is this all so serious? It looks like a mob boss about to like just put down. It's like put down the money, put it in the case. There's a meta and everything. Strange to realize how long ago it was. I haven't played since Sun and Moon. Oh yeah, no, it's been a been a while. Yeah, it's been a hot minute. Oh my god. Wow, this is the like CCB. literally rich man's Pokemon. Like, literally, this feels like Rich Man's Pokemon, the way that they're trying to describe it as. Yeah. So hold on, I have to fix the timer to crack. I'm not into the card game, so I really couldn't, like, I, I don't think I'd buy into this too much. Classic Pokemon trading card game. I guess are they like doing a re-release of the original? I guess I think that's what it was from what I heard from what I watched it mind you I was like hella tired. I woke up at like well, No, I didn't even wake up. I was class. awake the entire time just to watch this thing I guess already it's already working a on something. Pokemon trading card game classic is designed to be a premium Pokemon TCG set that will last a life Nendo wait really created by the design firm Nendo creatures and the Pokemon company as a joint production also, I think you're just like a few a seconds ahead of me. Of product at the Pokemon World Championships. So I huh. hope you will all come check it out. I was in the main games uh, and I have no idea either. We'd like uh, uh, as someone who's strictly Pokemon about VGC, I was completely unaware of what the hell's going on with Go. Yeah, no, same. We have Miss same. Young Kim from Netflix. <laughs> Mr. Ikihara, thank you for the kind introduction. Hi everyone. My name is Min Young Kim, and I hello Min Young Kim. Everyone say hello to Miss Min Young Kim. Thank you for having us here today. Oh, I remember this now. I was like, Pokemon and Netflix. I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, I was about to say. I thought I figured it was the anime. this year, at Netflix, we're passionate. Oh yeah, the new anime. Yeah, can you believe that they're no longer having Ash anymore? I know they're Ash is finally getting a break. Today, we're pleased to announce that Netflix, in collaboration with it the just Pokemon to me, it's company, insane because I'm like, what? The, we've had it for so many Netflix. years. It's kind of great though. Like, let him have a break finally. We have a group of experts here in Japan who are passionate about finding and developing original stories from. I'm really sad though because like I really would have loved to have seen him go to Haldea as like the last one. To Honestly, thank least. God I'm sick of that child. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh. I would have at least wanted 
them to see like the open worldness of it all and go to school at least one time, and then I'd be like, okay, we're good. I'm, I've had my fill. The Pokemon universe. Nah, let that's him me. have a break. Let him retire. Let him age. Let him be, become an adult finally. New world to life. I don't. We'll see. That's the thing, though. Like, we don't know what's gonna happen to him because, like, it's kind of like they're kind of letting him go entirely, and they're just having no involvement with him. Let Ash be able to become an adult. Follow the story of our concierge Haru and the many Pokemon who visit as guests. We hope you enjoy today's first look at the Netflix series Pokemon Concierge, and we can't wait to share more with you. People are theorizing one of the new protagonists Kokoa. is his child. Pokemon Ridoto. Yeah, there is a theory that that does because I think it was the, the girl because of her little hairpin looks like the same little logo that Ash had on his hat. Oh yeah, true, true. Also, During look the at that duck animation. Oh no, that's a uh, stop motion. I like it though. It's really nice. Pokemon Concierge. This is really cool. I like this. I'm not a huge fan of stop motion, but like honestly, it looks really clean. I'm down for it. Thank you very much, Miss Chen. Pokemon Concierge will be a new animated series brought to you by Netflix and Pokemon. I swear to God, is this an animation or is this like an animatronic Pikachu that he has next to him? I really am confused. We'd like to present the latest I don't know, honestly. It's kind of hard telling. Mr. Snowman, that rat is proper freaking me out. <laughs> yeah, it really is because it's like, what I is it? Is this like an animatronic? It. I kind of like it. I think it's cute, okay? From the Pokemon Company. Honestly, I barely paid attention during the first parts. I just wanted the Scarlet Violet news. That's fair. Hunt in the yeah, that is fair. Hell yeah, Honestly, I made I, I'm great kind of news. Today. The great work. Updates on the Pokemon I'm kind of on this. I was on the same Pokemon boat. I was like, I only care about Scarlet of, uh, Violet or like a new Scarlet. remake. Please take a look at the like, that's really where my head was at. Several of our other games. Ah, uh, yes, Unite, the uh, League of Legends of Pokemon. That's the game that got me back into League of Legends, fun fact. Really? I started playing Unite, and then it just evolved from there. I played it for a little bit, and I liked it, because uh, I, I do like MOBAs, I just don't like League. Like, I just hate League so profoundly, but I'll play anything other MOBA. Oh, Zacian. All right. Yeah, can I say, uh, there's a vast difference between League EU servers and League NA servers. Like, League NA servers are kind of fucking brain dead. Oh, absolutely. I play Sona, uh, bot, bot support. Um, I play Sona. Oh my gosh. NA, I fucking wreck house. EU, I get my shit handed sometimes, but like, yeah. Yeah, your, your hand is like, here, take this L. It's yeah, yours to take. take. The, yeah, take this. This belongs to you. I find it funny how people were expecting NSO game, uh, Pokemon games. Um, obviously, a lot of people were not aware of how Game Freak works. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Let's true. add the let's add the dog that destroyed Sword and Shield meta to the game with pay to win issue. Never played MOBAs. It's all right. Well, I'm not. I think the reason people were so hell bent on on seeing um the Pokemon games on NSO was because of the uh what was it the leaked thing with um. Pokemon Stadium, where apparently they removed uh, something from Stadium, where essentially you know how you could connect the Game Boy to uh, Stadium. Oh yeah, my brother was telling me about that. Yeah, and so how like they apparently had removed like the block that was not allowing people to use it, like it was just non-existent. Now they added it back yeah. in, and so they're like, hmm, that seems strange. So people were like, oh my god, it's coming, it's coming. I'm like, which again, people always looking too much too deep into it i'm like guys if it is happening it's not gonna happen here it just that doesn't seem like a smart idea like the pokemon is just the way that they are is this cafe mix wow also this food looks wow. really good holy crap you know what's funny you got it head on oh it is what's this? i figured it was cafe mix when i saw the food being made I was like, what the hell? Even I didn't know what this was. I was like, what the hell is this? And I was like, oh, cafe. I haven't seen this in years. Oh my gosh, the icons. <gasps> I love them. They're so cute. I might actually have to start playing uh, Cafe Mix. Uh, this event will be held March 17th, so about 13 days from now. Which one will you choose? To celebrate Pokemon Day and Pokemon Cafe Remix, we're also giving away a Oh, look at him. He's even got a little frying pan. Yo. And there's more. Presentation is always everything, but damn, exactly, yeah. Honestly, I stopped playing Cafe Mix after a couple minutes. It was boring. Now, see, I kind of like the Mad Fury ones. I liked Troze. It was a, it was a thing. 
it, it, you know, it's it's a fun, like, kind of, like, on the pooper sort of game. You're like, ah, oh, I'm just taking a shit. Hold on, let me just start playing this a little bit. And you're like, alright, I'm done. Yeah. These are not meant to get, like, hella hard into it. Like, if you are... Oh, this one confused me. I was like, oh, remake? And then I was like, no, I got lied to. Yo, I saw Steven for a second. Woo! I hope you're ready. Here we come. I love that they also are giving the voice actors these voice win. actors to some of the characters that From never had voice acting. Win. Yeah. Shine Which just makes me actually want voice acting in the games. It's like, god damn it. I like Cafe. Been playing it for a while. Uh, haven't spent any money on it. Yeah, same. Oh, yeah. I actually have, like, one of the events Steven's on there. Leon! The, the fucking yeah, best himbo! They finally gave him a voice. Love the himbo. I wanna be <gasps> Hop! Never. My little baby boy! And you get Zapdos, nice. Feed fuck out of here. Uh, you're cool, but also fuck you. <laughs> Thank you so well and good. I like his English VA, actually. Yeah, I, I, I actually honestly, like the I English VA. Oh, nice. yo, and Marnie, my daughter. Love her. If I remember correctly, that's, um, oh god, what's her face? Christina V. Yo, Craig, like, like, like Christina V? Hey, yo. That is, I'm pretty sure it is Christina Let's V who, who does Marnie, because I was like, I swear to god, that sounds like her. I could be hella wrong. Ooh, scout up to 100. Oh, I might have to go uh, log on to Masters EX, which I have not done in a hot minute. Um, for the that one notices, I never played. It's uh, like one of the only Pokemon stuff I just never touched. Oh, I played it a lot. Uh, I just kind of stopped after a bit. Hey, Coco, the top of the video is being cut off. Yeah, hold on. Let me hop back and fix that. When is my chance? Masters is another game I haven't played longer than an hour. When is my chance? I feel like my Pokemon would hate me if I played sleep because I feel like I I don't get I don't get adequate sleep. I'll wake up and go back to sleep again. Oh my god. Does not include AR functionality. Wow, what a dick. I want AR functionality though. There we go. I stopped playing for Masters EX. I haven't done anything since Gen 7. Uh, yeah, so still wait, don't have a mobile Gen phone 7. this day. What was Gen 7? Gen 7 was Sun and Moon. Holy crap, so you didn't get to play Sword and Shield and you didn't get to play Scarlet and Violet. Damn. Aw, oh, the little Pokemon things. Those are cute. Man, that's a long time ago. Holy crap, that's crazy to think about now. Okay, this is kind of cute animation. I'm gonna become a Pokemon uh, sleep champion. Ow, dark one! I'm gonna be a nap champion. Bead clears hop. Like, I, well, I you Pokemon know, <laughs> Bead's still a bitch. I started with Gen 6, stopped until about 8, uh, and then got very much back into it again. <laughs> I want to be spooned by Pangor. <laughs> I think for me, I want to snuggle up with, um, God, what Pokemon was it? A Lapras. Give me the Lapras. You know the life-size Lapras that they have? Yeah, I want that I shit. want a Snorlax, a giant Snorlax cushion to lay on. I love Lapras. He's a big lanky boy. And Hop's a pathetic loser. A pop is great. Fuck you, Pangy. Whoa. Don't you talk Damn. about my son like that. A hop? Wow, wow. Why are we getting the hop hate up in here? I go, go. Yo, is that the motherfucking JoJo? Also, the professor is adorable. I love him. I'm glad we got a chunky guy for once. He's cute. And you talked about me. That's my son. Well, your son's shit. My son can kick... Actually, no. My son can't kick your son's ass. I can kick your son's ass. I can kick your son's ass. It's like, I protect my son. What are you going to do? Nothing. <laughs> like, I hate myself. I'll kick your ass. I bitch try! Also, hi, Jojo. I'm laughing, bro. And I mean, we haven't even gotten to the crux of the video. <laughs> Literally. Yeah.
literally it's like it's like today it's just like nah man we're not gonna have a good mind cast you, you know honestly if, if it's not a little bit funky wonky is it really like a mind cast that's you know what you're not wrong but yo everyone coming over from ak side if you don't know who i am good morning afternoon evening i'm buttery coco but please feel free to call me coco or katie i'm a variety streamer here on twitch and i'm your favorite exiled royal i'm on my wrong window wait has anyone ever called you katie uh, yeah, the Ka Katie's normally what I actually went by before I joined Twitch and went by Coco, fun fact. Oh, okay. Yeah. like, I, I, you always say that, and I'm just like, I don't And some people really see, do I, call me Katie. Coco. Like, Ashley, when you see her in chat, she calls me Katie, because I've known her since I was, like, 13. Mm, mm -hmm. Yeah, so some people do, and I don't mind if anyone does here, like, because th that's who I am. Coco and Katie are two nicknames for the same person. Same. <laughs> Same name, same person, you know? No, I totally get it. I just was, like, curious, because I just, I, I, I pondered it, because you, I've never really heard anyone say Katie before on your channel, so that's why I, yeah, I no. only hear Coco. Yeah, no, Ashley does, um, and then Jay, uh, Bluebird Jay does, too, because they know me also as Katie. Um, I think pretty much anyone I met before Twitch will probably call me Katie more so. Uh, Soggy's um, asking, is it I-E or Y? I-E. Uh, never gone by a real name, though, or even a pseudonym. I've had some pung before Solaris for a long outside, which also I never knew that... Soul, can I apologize? I did not know until you sent me that DM that you were Solaris. I, 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 some, I thought of you guys as two separate people for the longest fucking time. I had no idea. You're like, well, I wonder what happened to Solaris, and you're like, oh my god, that are they still here? They're the same person! <laughs> I am so sorry about that. That's the Bro. point. I well, it made it made me feel like I had a heart attack and was old. I just want you to know that. Um. Yeah, you made Coco feel. Yeah, let's keep making Coco feel older. <laughs> let's go. Also, I think other people might have known except me. Um. So yeah. <laughs> anyway. Um. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Here, I'm back on that one. But yeah. Uh. Hopefully, stream was good. Um. AK, if you're still here, or if anyone from your stream is still here, I did not expect my stuff to just kind of die. Apologies again uh, for that. Yeah. Uh, we'll have a nice little haha -ha funny stitch moment for, um, you know, the YouTube video. Some closer friends would have known, but most people would have known uh -huh. one or the other. I Well, I'm glad to know both. And I still feel like a dumbass. Oh my, oh my what? Soggy, you're gonna be older in two days? Holy shit, happy day two days older. Yo, yo, who's got a birthday? Soggy in two Yo, days. Yo, Soggy! Happy birthday! In two days. Wait, wait, wait. It's in, in two, two days, though. In two days. Yo, happy early birthday! <gasps> Yo! Okay, so did we want to start back with the video? I think we're on, like, 15.05 is what I have mine stopped at. I have 16.14 uh, because I didn't know. All right, well, we'll go back to, like, I'd say just get it as close to 15. Start. Let me know when you're ready. Oh my god, that's like literally the beginning of the po oh the Pokemon sleeve. Oh my god, it's not the beginning of the Pokemon sleeve. Are we actually no wait no no I think I stopped on the Go Plus. Hold on, it, I, okay. So where's the Go Plus start? Uh, one week before the new WWE game, so presents were easy to get. Uh, presents were easy to get for me this year. Hell yeah! So it's closer to sixteen. So like when they announced the Pokemon Go thing. Okay, so right, go I'm gonna put it, it in sixteen oh two. There we go. Snorlax's, you know, dude, Snorlax's beautiful face. <laughs> all right, all right, ready? All right, three, two, two one, one, go. go. Goofy sleep. Yeah, tag yourself, guys. Um, I sleep Groupie with my, years. I sleep with my face like face down in the pillows. Um, I I'm a side sleeper. I do sleep on my side, yo, but then also freaking, sometimes. Bro. Who's done that yo. Today? <laughs> What have you been up to, mate? Summer? Bro, everything's coming on the summer, man. Let's go. Your summer's back with Boston. Dude, I know, right? Because I'm about to get Ghost Trick, Bat and Kratos 1 and 2, uh, Rhapsody. I'm also a face down sleeper. Face down up against the wall. Oh, whoa. Axel coming out. <laughs> what about, babe? The Pokemon Go Plus no, I was just imagining Axel. See, because freaking Soggy was just like... Press against the wall, so I'm imagining Axel doing the like wall hand thing in the anime, if you know the ones. Oh, Cabadon. 
Yeah. Not a plot twist. It'd be mean. I'd be doing like the cicada one where it's like arms and legs. Bruh. <laughs> just the most feral thing ever. Just like, ah! I am pretty feral. We already know this. He's gotta have you on a leash. <laughs> There's like something, I, there's leash, something I could say off. to that, but it is not appropriate. I'm gonna just... Whoa! Oh, okay. <laughs> anyway. I was not ready for that. Anyway, I am a face-down sleeper, but I also do sleep on my side. And I try to sleep on my side more, because, like, I know it's better for your back than sleeping face-down. But sometimes I just want to sleep like I'm dead, you know? Yeah, exactly. S feel like I'm suffocating myself every time I wake up. Just like, I'm right there! Oxygen! You know, my neck and spine, fuck them. <laughs> I don't need it till I'm 80. Oh, you know, uh, this is what sucks. I have to get back into Pokemon Go now. I mean, you don't Not because of the, 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 the Pokemon Go Plus, but it's it, there's, there's reasons why I say I have to get back into Pokemon Go. Why is that? No, yo, just wait. Just wait. I have completely given up on my it, health. But... Why is that, Sam? The Pokemon Go Plus July 14th should be available to purchase <coughs> Fair enough. And by linking the Pokemon Go Plus Plus to your Pokemon Go game, oh, that's you'll cute. get access to special research in Pokemon Go that will allow you to encounter a Snorlax wearing a nightcap. That is actually cute. I like Look that. Look forward to more news to come about Pokemon Sleep and the Pokemon Go Plus Plus device. That Go Plus is like $65. The, yeah, the Go Plus Plus. Like, the Go Plus was already pricey. Lung cancer, to be completely honest. Like, oh, oh. Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon oh, gosh. Violet. I am sorry the to hear that solely. Oh. Which were released in November last year. Wait, what happened? Uh, nuts. Alright. I respect it. Yeah. Oh, my God! It's no Paradox Pokemans! Oh yeah, I still need to get waking, um, walking wake. Do you want? Do you want me to help? Eh, I guess. I've just been. It's more like been trying to like get onto it online. All the lobbies. Oh yeah, the fill online's pretty garbage. Fast. I was like, well, cause I have like Scarlet, so I was like, I I have it more readily available. But if you really need it, I can you know help you out with that. Thanks, gamer. New paradox Pokemon. Anytime, man. In the Paldea region. I will say though, out of the two, I like walking, walking wake a lot more design wise. Scarlet. While iron leaves can be found yeah, in I got them both on day one and found a shiny flamingo on the way. Nice. You'll be able to catch them for yourself by claiming victory in a What's like that they're not a part of the Pokedex? Because I really wanted to know more about it. I was like, God damn it. Yep. As as are complete. I, that's what I really dislike about like when they have event People Pokemon. They don't add to the Pokedex. So you have no idea of like lore wise. And these very clearly have lore to them. But I'm just like, God, you bastards. Will also soon be able to Here it is. Pokemon Go. I'm doing good, just been sorting through some of my most recent Go. game haul. Ooh, what'd you get? Hey, yo, Pat, let me know. I want to know, I want to know, I want to know. These gifts come with postcards. These gifts come with postcards. Once it's possible to connect these games, you'll be able to send postcards to your Pokemon. Oh, I have to send gifts! No! <laughs> hey, Coco. Hey, what? Do you have Pokemon Go? And on the Pokemon Go side, the players I'll send it to you later. Will find themselves able okay, because I'm like, I don't have postcards. I don't have friends on Pokemon Go. Hey, Coco, what's up? Yo, Pats, how's it going, gamer? There's a potential, um, this corrupts your save file, by the way. <laughs> what? Early this year. Then you'll be able to bring roaming I know, I re that's what I wanted for. It's just roaming, Pokemon roaming form gimme goal. That's all I need, man. I don't care about anything else. We hope you look forward to it. I don't have friends in general. Well, you have Finally, us some. We'd like to share yeah, that is true. Last video for today with you. I know oh, we're not is, much. Is thing? But we're something. Please have a look at this. Let's be careful about this. Oh, yeah, the apparently the gimme cool thing. Like, mess things up. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, here's the, the this is the trailer. Ha, 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 ha. I was like, wait, what? Manzana. No, the pavilion thing. Oh, the pavilion thing. The pavilion? Really? Ooh, festival. Huh. Weird.
There it is. Oh yeah, the new mons. I, this is why I'm like, I really want this DLC, but I'm also like too broke to be like getting it, you know? Especially since the second one seems to be a lot bigger in comparison to the, the first one. Yeah, but the first one's got some... Oh my gosh, I have to read the comment Pangy said. It's 35 for both of them. Yeah, it's 35. That's what I'm saying. It's pretty expensive. Like, it's, it's, it's decently expensive to get it. And it doesn't just let you have, like, one or the other. You have to buy both. Yeah, I'll probably just wait till they both come out, though. I'd like to pre-order it, but like again, that's really just up to I guess. Look at this my goofy finances. little man, I love him. Teal mask. He's so silly. This one is interesting because it has all the different elemental typings in its like little core crystal. That's why I was like, huh, I wonder what this means. I wonder what the significance is. And then is. I love the turtle for part two. Like it feels like it has a very deep connection with Rastalizations. That's what I was like, hmm. You get a Hisui and Zoark for pre-ordering? Yeah, you do get that, and you get something, I like some of the other things. I love Hisui and Zoark. It's like one of my favorite versions of Zoark. Like, yeah, no, it's Did very cool. Of area zero. Favorite versions of Zoark? There's only two, <laughs> including it. Area zero will be released in two parts. With part one, the teal mask, coming in fall 2020. Fall and winter, so they're like pretty close together. Part two. And then this is where, this is where there's some like rumors coming from it, and I, I, First I'll talk about it when we get there. Okay. Will allow you to enjoy playing both parts of the DLC with the save data you already have in Pokemon Scarlet or Pokemon Violet. Wow! Pets, like, what game console did in you get these games for? Are they like like masks. newer consoles? Are they PS One? Because I know you got a PS One. Been sorting through my most recent game haul. Nice. I don't remember the specifics, but it can corrupt your Scarlet and Violet and save data. It's Thirty-five both of them. You get a Hisuian, Zorark, and the DL outfits for the DLC and a Cherish Ball. Cherish Ball is fairly meaningless. I mean, oh, the Cherish Ball is like literally like pointless. Yeah, it's cute You'll though. You'll be able to encounter some familiar Pokemon that you didn't see living in Paldea. That's, That's cool that we get new Pokemon as well. I really hope we do get Pokemon, Pokemon uh, entries for them as well. I really do. The hidden treasure of Area Zero are Ogre Palm. I also regret now buying into masks. the Sword and Shield one because the DLC for that one was like pretty meh. Except for the second one. The second one was pretty decent. It was fun. Please but like even then, it's still meh. That will in two this one seems to be a lot more in depth, and I'm like, god damn it. That both these Pokemon will Don't I feel like a, just an idiot for doing the other one? The treasure of Area Zero will be I mean, yeah, but still. Shortly after this presentation. I know it's not the fuck. It's fun, um, but it doesn't carry down or anything. As soon as you make your purchase, you'll be able to get the new uniform set. I like the new unit. <sighs> I kind of wish we had skirts still. Like, even with shorts under. I'd rather there take it is. That. Early purchase, purchase especially his suit. Yeah. Knows happy hour. Terra Dark type has a charismatic mark. Oh, yeah, the mark things that are like rare. Also, yeah, the top is cut off still, but it's fine. In the Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet games. And that's everything. What I like it. Okay, so if we figured out yet if the Pikachu is an animation or if it's an animatronic. Yeah, we never really figured out because it, it looks it like has an animatronic. A, it has a reflection on the Thank table, though. In. I think it's an animatronic. It, it just feels so animatronic, but it could be an animation. They could have literally gone through and done that. I don't know. It looks more of That's an animatronic. Really I nuts. think it is an animatronic. I... All right. Uh, let me pop my music back on. Yeah, let me pop my music back on as well. All right, so but yes, can... would you like to... I, with the, our, it's our thoughts and feelings about him. It's definitely an animatronic. Okay, Peggy, it could have been that thing could have easily been a an animation. Like it's possible with technology nowadays. Like if, if fake deeps are a thing, that being animated is also entirely possible. Um, There's a strong possibility, yeah. Yeah. So, um, what do we want to break down on first? Like, I'm assuming you want to crack down into the Scarlet Violet stuff. Um, let's start with, like, simple things. I could, I, we could go with Pokemon Sleep, because the other ones I feel like are I, pretty straightforward. They're just like, here's a new game in the franchise. That's about it. Pokemon Sleep seems cool. I will probably be awful, um, you know, at, at it, because I my sleep quality is about equivalent to a wet paper straw. Yeah, um, I would but say. But it's <laughs> still cool. I like the new Professor. I think he's cute. I'm glad we actually have a chubby character for once. That isn't it's like it's nice. that isn't yeah. marked to being like fucking um like comedy like whatever his name trio from the X and Y people. Also, I'm being oh yeah 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 yeah. 
those chuckle nuts that I could never tell you who they are. Ah, uh, yes, I remember who you're referring to. Yep. Oh, um, but yeah. So I, cool. I look forward to seeing Pokemon Sleep, even if it seems a little silly. I at least will give it a try. Um, yeah, as I was saying on stream before things, um, you know, cut down. I mm -hmm. did actually open up, um, <laughs> uh. Uh, Pokemon uh, EX. Uh, yeah, the EX stuff. Yeah, so you're yeah, just like, hold on, uh, let me get so it right I'm now. So I'm like collecting no, no, no. all my stuff right now, all my rewards. Oh my god, that's hilarious. So like, you're, you're into that. Um, I think it's cool for some of the other things that we got. Like, I mean, we got like cool art for the Pokemon event, classic, uh, Pokemon card game. So I'm like, that's really cool for anyone who's really into that. Um, what else was there? Oh, uh, Day Season coming to uh. Unite is pretty cool. So it's like, hey, we finally got some newer Pokemon now. I mean, it's granted it's a legendary, and I'm like, it's pretty busted from what I see. It's like, mm. hope yeah. that's not a part of the meta. Uh, I'm trying think what else. Do, 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 do. Um, Cafe remake. That's pretty cool. I'm not a huge fan of the remake stuff, like a cafe stuff, but I think it's still pretty cool nonetheless. Yeah. I was trying to remember, what was it before it became the Cafe remix? Because it was originally Troze, and then it was the mobile game. Pokemon no, it was something. on 3DS, remember? There was Pokemon Cafe on 3DS. Yeah, no, but no, no, there was the one before it, though, that was the Match 3. That was, like... I think there was... I'm trying to remember what it was called. And I can't remember. It's like, I used to play it, so it's like, how could I forget? Oh, here it is, Pokemon Shuffle! Yeah. Shuffle. Oh, Shuffle, yeah, 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 yeah. okay. Also, that Shuffle is... Si Are you still in service? Or uh, did shuffle? Sorry, it was fine. I was busy. It was one of those grab bag type bundles where they give you like 30 random games for charity or whatever. Oh, Humble Bundle? Is that what you're referring to? Oh, yeah, Humble Bundle. Yeah, I was like, okay, I just clicked in my head Humble Bundle. Yeah, I, I've never messed with Humble Bundle. I don't think I have. It's all right. Um, I don't really like them nowadays because a lot of their stuff doesn't go to charities anymore. They got rid of the option for you to set how much of a percentage goes to charity, which fucking really? sucks. But, you know yeah um that, that's awful yeah so, so now i guess it, i might play pokemon sorry, cafe yeah sorry yeah, no that's fine uh there's the pokemon go accessory which i think it's really cool i think it's like a new fun feature but i'm like i just cannot be bought into it anymore man like i just i'm too i can't they had just had like as a kid i probably would have bought into it easily but now nah dude i'm like i have other things i gotta purchase other Hell, I need yeah. to buy a new computer. You think I'm gonna buy into that? Like, eh. Yeah, the Pokemon Go Plus Plus, yeah, definitely not. Um, also, Peggy just said Humble Bundle apparently had a big charity thing for the Earthquake and Turkey. Yeah, like, they'll still do big charities like that, but if I'm buying, like, an individual game thing um, with a certain other bundles, like, they just... I don't know why they decided to get rid of the chance for you to show how much goes into... Like, set your percentage for whatever goes into charity. Oh, Because I okay. think they only... Because if I recall correctly, they only said it's, like, 15% or so goes to charity. Um, on, like, certain things aside from their big charity events, like, that they host. Like, mm -hmm. that. Which is the reason why I stopped using Humble for a long time. Really? Yeah. Unless they finally, like, change that shit back so that I can set it so that a majority of whatever my purchase is will go to charity. I don't know. I, I couldn't be able to tell you, dude. I don't- I've never used Humble Bundle. I've used- uh, fanatical that I've used for like deals and stuff and like something else I've used but like I've never used that it's still cheaper than steam most time yeah no Peggy that's not the thing that I, I yeah it's still cheaper than steam but my whole thing is a majority of the money goes to them and not the charity nowadays because of that one change they made a few years back I used humble bundle once uh, and it was in 2021 they had a bundle for all the Sonic games um, at the time aside from the classics like I don't care if it's cheaper than steam that's not what bugs me right I'm just saying you're saving money yeah, I know, like, I, and saving money's nice and all, but I also kind of like things going to charity more than Yeah, saving you like supporting money. a charity. You're like, yeah. I like game, but also supporting the charity. Steam takes all the doing. money, too, but also Steam isn't out here saying, oh, yeah, we're going to support charities, Pangy. Steam doesn't outright do that. It's the whole principle of how no. Humble Bundle is, which is what made me stop using it. Humble Bundle was which founded on supporting charity, like, these good causes and doing charity work, and they would let you, the buyer, have the chance to put how much of a percentage of your purchase goes to a charity? Um, yeah, and right. taking that away, just like, yeah, it, it's kind of dog shit. Trust me, Steam takes all my money, too, when I make purchases, yes. But also, at the same time, it's a you know, it's, it's like, a business it's and they are not saying that this is going to charity. Yeah, you know? it, it's not like a charitable thing. It's more like we're you're paying for the game and it's like, yeah, well, no. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Uh, I still use Itch.io, honestly, nowadays. Um... 
They do. Ishio. Really yeah. yeah, Ishio. They're they're pretty good. Um, um I've used Ishio. I think it once, and that was during the like Ukraine event. And I know people were like, "Go for it." It's like over like six hundred. It's like some ludicrous amount of games. So I'm like, "Ah, oh, fuck, it's fine." Yeah, and I did it. Yeah, and like a lot. I was saying, yeah, a lot of the stuff that you'll get in like the big bundles on Ichio sometimes aren't necessarily like things you will use. Like there's a lot of like dev tools for game developers that I have like oh, in absolutely. a bundle from mine for like social, like for equal justice. Um, yeah, I was gonna yeah. say there's some game dev stuff. So there's some like other like tools for like creation that it's like, well, I'm not doing this. So I'm like, well, well, that's <laughs> useless. But there's also some really cool games and things like that. Yeah, that is true. I will say there were some brilliant games. It's just kind of like a, a, a mixed bag of like, oh, cool creation things that are like, I'm never going to use or, oh, fun games. Yeah. I wish you could just pick and choose. You could just be like, I don't want this, but like, I'll take this, you know, kind of like kind of what they did with Humble Bundle where it's like, I can pay less, but I get the things that I want. Yeah. And you still like know at least the majority of that purchase is still going to the charity. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Kind of um, that, that mixture of the two of them. Yeah. Uh, so then, okay, so moving from that, I guess it's just the Pokemon Go, like Pokemon Scarlet and Violet stuff, but what'd you think of, like, the, uh, the integration of Go and then, obviously, the new, uh, Paradox that are the newest things right now? I'm glad we're getting an integration of Go, finally. I am yeah, it took very a while. glad. Um, let's see, what else? Uh, and, yeah, that's really, that's about it, it's just, like, the, uh... The Go integration, the Paradox Pokemon that are like obviously right now. Then there's obviously the DLC, which I think it looks really good. I'm really excited. It seems like they're genuinely trying with these ones to make something more meaningful rather than it being sort of like a one-off thing. Because I could tell that with Sword and Shield, they were very segmented from each other. Like both DLCs were like completely separated, had no relation to each other. Well, these two seem to be more in connection. Like there's a cohesive story going on here that they're trying to tell for both of them. Yeah, which is very nice for them to like do. I, I appreciate exactly. that. Um, I I like the ideas of it, and I like the new mods. Um, also, uh, I have to, Pengi, I have to read the comment that you made on the one monkey from the Jaded Mask one. Um, like, what did he say? How he described the monkey is the best thing I have read. It is. Let me see. Ten, I, I will read this out. Oh, I need to hear this. <laughs> the descriptor. Was this beautiful? I, I assume you're fine with me reading this out, Peggy. Oh, um, I, I need to hear this. All right, so hey, yo, what's up, Dead Shot? How you doing? All right, so what's up, you yes, yes, monkey? Yo, he, he sent me he sent me all of the artworks. Um, so yeah, we have like the bird. Um, I'm not even gonna try. Uh, wait, Fez, uh, Pheasant, Pheasant Dippity. Okay, I kind of like that name. Um, the cat bear looking thing okie dogie oh it's a dog okie dogie okay i like that oh uh, okay um the uh legendary ogre pawn um and then monkey dory who is this monkey one Doria. yeah peggy initially Bruh. saying they're dorpy as fuck and it's like i like them all and especially the last one uh oh uh monkey dory and peggy in the best sentence i think i've ever heard of a descriptor of a pokemon he looks zesty, and you can't tell me different. I, I just, there's something about the descriptor of that. It's perfect. It's, it's like, it, it makes sense somehow, it and I don't, does. I don't know it's why. Beautiful. He's it zesty. really hit exactly he's, what it is. He's, he's, he just came to bug. God damn it, why does everyone want to bug me? Well, I appreciate you coming out there, Chad, at least. He's zesty. He's very zesty. You're very zesty. Mm. I love it. Hey, yo, somebody um, get the zester. We need to get all this juice out of him. Yeah, <laughs> but I, I do like all of the mons. I think they're pretty great. Um, oh, they're great. They look nice. They're really well designed. I can really tell they did try with them. I look forward to seeing the DLC, especially since I didn't actually play the Sword and Shield DLC. Uh, you never, didn't? Oh, so you I... didn't get burned like me. Nope. Uh, yeah, I you lucked out. <laughs> yeah, I guess I did. Um... But yeah, uh, I, I will admit the one thing I am a little upset by is I truly wish that the DLC outfits we would get had a skirt option. Because I know a lot of people were wanting that. Like, even if it was like with the skirts and pass where there's shorts underneath it, you know, I would have just yeah, no, that's rather fine. that. It's just like something. Yeah. I guess oh. they sh they could, but I, it's up to them. It's up to Pokemon. It's really in balls on their court. I, they could add them as DLC stuff, like costumes and stuff later on, but I don't know. I doubt it. 
it would be nice if they did, but also I ain't holding my breath. But yeah, I ain't holding my breath either for that. Maybe one. one day we'll have skirts back again, and I can rejoice in having my legs out. <laughs> it's just free, free but... of my pants. <laughs> yes, uh, one day I'll be free of my leg prisons, but today is not that day. Nintendo says so. Yeah, exactly. M Nintendo Shama told me I can't take them off just yet, so I just gotta keep them on. <laughs> Nintendo looked at us and said, go fuck off. <laughs> uh, but now that leads into the, the obviously the rumor aspect, so just be aware, be aware. Like, oh, if you yeah. guys want to hear rumors or whatever, you, you're rumor more than thing. welcome to tune out now. Rumor things, yes. We were going to talk about that, yes, too. Yes, this is a rumor mill. So, um, apparently yeah. on 4chan, I don't know where the... I'm not going to go on 4chan right now to find it. That's a but great idea not to do. There was a uh, a gentleman who was a, a part of a, um, obviously, a company that works as a... Um, not subsidiary, what's the word? Um, contractor for the Pokemon company. So, they're a contractor company for the Pokemon company for Nintendo. And apparently, he outlined everything that was going to be in this present. Except for one thing that was announced that he stated that no one else has stated, which is that apparently they're making a model update that's going to come out around the time of the second DLC for their newest model Switch, as in, like, the new version of the Switch. Like, something even newer. Like, it's not like a Switch 2, it's not a Switch Pro, it's like an actual new console. Um, Switch 2 confirmed, mill... guys! <laughs> yeah, exactly. And everyone's been taking it as, like, essentially fact and have been running with it and there's, like, more rumors coming out, blah, blah, blah. And I know right now, I think Nintendo also did something that doesn't help their case, which is that they um, recently banned, I think, someone who was a factory worker for, I think, some, for a tech company, or not a tech company, for one of their factories. They banned them because they were a known leaker. So oh. They banned them. <laughs> and so those people are like, oh my god, it's confirmed. I'm like, again, I, I have to raise my eyebrow and be like, yeah, it's a bit suspicious, but I'm like, also by the same token, I think they just don't want to add fuel to the fire because they're like, yeah. bro, we don't, we don't want to keep adding to it, especially yeah. since, you know, if it is true, which to me it seems odd, because I'm like, why would a contractor know about the Switch 2? That yeah, just, to me, that sus. seems like very ass, like, very dumb, and almost like non-Nintendo, because Nintendo are very private about these things. They don't ever release them, they don't tell a lot of people. Yeah. Uh... Especially not contractors, <laughs> that just doesn't make any exactly. sense. Why would a contractor need to know about their new console? That doesn't yeah. make sense. Especially, like, to not have them sign an NDA for something like that. It, yeah, it's very suspicious. Also, uh, Kiwi says, I do not believe that for a minute. I'm sorry. Yeah, no, I don't think any of us really believe that for a minute. No, I don't believe it. I, I, well, but then again, I've heard it so many times, cried wolf, from, like, so many different sources at this point, that I'm just so jaded. I'm like, until I see it, I don't believe it. I'm yeah. sorry. But we've had it so many times. And the last time we had it, it did lead to a Switch model. But it was the OLED, and everyone yeah. was massively disappointed. So that's why I was like, I'm not going to buy into it, because I just can't believe it. Especially since this year, we're getting the sequel to Breath of the Wild. We're getting Pikmin. We might be getting the Metroid game, maybe? Um, That one is kind of like, I don't know. But yeah, we got Pikmin. We have uh, Zelda. I think we have another Nintendo game that I'm just like neglecting to remember from the Direct. Um, let me boot it up. We got a something. Like other game. It was something else that I was like, everyone was super hyped for. Um, Hold on. Let me double check. Give me like a second. But essentially, there is a bunch of things coming out and it just doesn't make a lot of sense for them to be like, hey, let's start announcing uh, their new Hello there, you know, thing. It just doesn't, you know. We have a, we have a baby joining us now. Uh, yeah, Mr. Excite Bike himself. Uh, find it. I'm trying to find Nintendo. That's okay. I have to hold my cat and <laughs> tell him that he's a baby. But yeah, like, no, no, that, that's that's where my head's at, is like, you know, and, and it's worse too because people are like adding fuel to the fire by being like, oh, someone else confirmed it, someone else confirmed this. I'm like, I can't. Hey, you know what? Just... <laughs> if, and if your friends said they were going to jump off a building, would you join them? Maybe. Yeah, it's quite literally that, but like, yeah. yeah, it's like, I... And Nintendo with like the Nintendo ninjas and everything, it just, it makes no sense for them to like be so risky with something like that, especially with how people have leaked shit in the past like god forbid we saw how like exclusive and secretive they became with even um demos for the games and how much they cut out because people data mine so much out of them exactly like, oh my god so it just doesn't make sense for nintendo no, it really doesn't to, to let the pokemon company know of this and then let a contractor then know of the new switch model they just be like here update these models for us they wouldn't say why because it's irrelevant to them 
Yeah. You know, like, what would be the point of telling the contractor, we're making a new Switch model, you know? Like, that doesn't make sense. For yeah. even, if you even take it logically from, like, a, a business perspective, what would you have to gain to tell them that there's a new Switch model? Nothing. Exactly. Hey, because it doesn't matter to them. They're going to make the models regardless. They just have to change the power of it. They can make an assertion, be like, oh, there probably is because of the amount of power to run these models. But to them to outright state the fact to them, like, oh, yeah, this is for a new Switch model, I just can't, can't. Oh, goodbye, Excite. He just slid down. Um, and so that's what's been really bugging me, and I just keep getting it on my YouTube feed, and I'm just like, bruh, come on. See, that's why I'm glad my YouTube feed is not of things like that. Uh, and it is curated towards memes and just videos from people. Like, I, I get a lot more video essay stuff, which is great because I like watching video essays. Hell yeah, same. Well, I think it's just because I like to be in the know of games, and so, like, I like to, you know, like to know rumors and stuff, but, like, when it comes to, like, obviously Switch Pro, I've just kind of tuned that out at this point, and I just kind of moved on from it and just accepted, like, if it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't. And it probably isn't. Yeah. Nine times out of ten. And, um... But I know, like, there's a, there was another rumor. Like, I knew, uh, what is it called? Um, Baton Kratos. I think I talked to you about it earlier, um, which is this amazing... Um, Monolith Soft slash Bandai Namco uh, RPG, card RPG. It's amazing. I'll show it to you sometime. I'll show, I'll show you the trailer. But they're releasing it as a remaster on Switch. There was a rumor that they were working on something for Baton Kratos because there was a, um, what was it? A patent. Well, not a patent. A title that was sent to the ESRB. And they always have to do that for games. They have to send up the ESRB title names and stuff like that for yeah. legal reasons. So that got released and people were like, oh my god, it's happening! And I was like, maybe? that, But that it seemed strange to me. I was like, that's weird. But I could see it probably happening because it's on a legitimate site. Like, it's literally on the ESRB, ESRB site, and it makes sense to me that it would be legitimate. It wouldn't make a lot of sense that they put that up there for no reason. Yeah. Also, sorry. So, I have a cat on my shoulder, no. and I'm hearing his <laughs> stomach in hers. That's why I'm tilting this way. <laughs> you're like, oh, you're heavy. Oh, I'm gonna... Uh. I know, because I'm not heavy. It's just he likes sitting on my shoulder. Like... He will jump up that way, and he'll have me, like, carry him around on it. Uh, I just don't follow Switch or just... Nintendo stuff in general. That, yeah, that's, that makes sense some. Um, yeah, that's fair. Yeah. I think the only other thing that I know of rumors that would make me excited is that, which, again, rumors, uh, apparently Konami's supposed to be apparently doing a little bit more with Castlevania A3 this year, which makes me, like, oh, well. Oh, well. You say Castlevania? Oh, well. Yeah, I'm um, dude. Listen, we already have the Dead Cells event, which is Return to Castlevania, which I pre oh yeah, I saw that. I, I was like, wow. So, I was so excited. And what's you know what sucks too during the because it was at the Game Awards. I literally was like, hold on, there's probably nothing important because this was like pre-show. Nothing important ever shows up on pre-show nine times out of ten. So I was like, ah, it's fine. I'll go take a like a whiz real quick and I'll come back. Literally, as I come back, they're screaming for me. Everyone in the chat, they're like, oh my god, Riker, it's it's, it's Castlevania. Like, <laughs> it's Castlevania. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. It was like the immediate first thing. I was like, fuck! Bro, what the hell? I needed to take a piss. Could you not have dropped something awesome like that See, immediately? That's just your fault, Riker. Maybe you should have just pissed someone else's pants. Oh my god. You're, maybe you're right. You're yeah. right. Oh. Um, copyright's just too much of a pain, and there are so many complications that I pirate what I want in re that regard, but usually that's nothing outside of like stuff like Mother 3. Yeah, Mother 3? Ha it has about as much of a chance, um, you know, coming to newer consoles as Kablam does coming to Kablam. DVDs. Fun Bruh. fact, Kablam will never be on DVDs, and you know why? Why? Because of motherfucking Angela Anaconda! <laughs> the person who owns the rights to that would not give it up. And because Angela bitch-ass Anaconda had a few shorts on Kablam before she had her own dumbass TV show, we will never see Kablam on DVD. I fucking yeah, hate it, Angela, Angela Anaconda. It's an awful show with a horrible premise. The characters are unlikable. But God forbid, I hate her ass even more because Kablam was perfect. The, that was some pure rage right there. Yeah, no, it's 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 up there with the uh, the PT never coming out, and it was gonna have Juji Ito, um, on top of you know, Guillermo del Toro and Kojima, and it's like, yeah, uh, oh, I'm yeah, not yeah, yeah. I'm not mad, I'm not mad, I'm not mad, I'm not coping and seething, I'm not mad, I'm not mad, I'm beyond pissed. Also, I just heard your switch. Yeah, sorry, no, no, because there's also one other thing, uh, because I know you you like this Fatal Frame, because I think they're finally. Yes, Fatal Frame. Yeah, Fatal Frame. Frame Four is coming out this month. Uh, it's like the 23rd, I think, or something. Um, yeah, Fatal Frame. Let me double check you. 
Yeah, it's something like that. Uh, Fatal Frame 4, Curse of the ninth. Lunar Eclipse. Oh, it's the ninth? The nice. Ninth. Nice! That's in five yep. days. Um, which, oh, speaking of Fatal Frame, um, the channel point redeem for me playing Fatal Frame 5 is still going on. We are at 52% raise. Oh, okay. I was like, what? It was like 70 bucks. I'm like, that's not right. How is it 70 bucks? <laughs> Yo, hi, honey. How are you? Dude, Bomb. I got hella confused for 10 seconds. I was yeah, like, that no, does not make no the way sense. How is a game that's that old? cost that much and then i was like oh right it's the bundle pack um i could have no, spun like my bucks. points on that fuck hello hi babe how are you um um but yeah what? i'm definitely going to be playing it i look forward to it um so yeah we might even stream um fatal frame 4 honestly just Hell like oh yeah i mean i pop in on that <laughs> yeah just like streaming fatal frame 5 because fuck that game <laughs> Fuck that game. Oh no. my god. Oh no, you I still have... have that personal vendetta for it, huh? Um, no, it was awful. Like it's in it is the worst fatal frame game in the entire series. Made Would you in like... Blackwater, the Made Wii U in one? Blackwater, yes, is the worst one. And if it wasn't for the localization of four, that would have been the end of the legacy for Fatal Frame in the West. Also, babe, thank you so much for your contribution to the stream. I appreciate it. Um, I might show it if I have time, but Oracle keeps me busy often. I could have spent, spent my points on that fuck. Yeah, don't worry, Sum. You will always be able to get points. Um, oh, I just yeah. remembered. I was like, I had something to say real quick, because I was like, you brought up the NSO real quick and about Game Boy and like how... Oh, yeah, Nintendo coming. Online, bro, yeah. Bro, when that, uh, like, when that was announced, when they said the Game Boy was coming, literally, there was a, t like, a hashtag for, like, the Earthbound fans. Like, well, I don't remember exactly <laughs> what it was, but it's in the essence of, like, don't tease us. Don't, don't They're us. like, don't, don't, don't play with our emotions, Nintendo. I please. know, right? And it's like, I feel you. And even I said it on camera. Or, or, I, well, I had a clip. Oh. Of, I had a video of it. I didn't. I don't know where it went. I lost it. it. It lost to the ether of my computer. I don't know where it went. But I had it. I literally stated in that video, dude. They, if they don't put Earthbound in here, don't tempt me. Don't do this to me, because I know you guys are. Because at this point now, you can do it. You could, but you chose not to. You already know they they will not do it. We already know. The last time that Earthbound was, uh, don't, don't what? Don't give me hope. Yeah, don't give me hope. There <laughs> it is. It's don't give me hope. That was the hashtag. Yeah, it's like, don't, don't give, give me hope. hope. Yeah. And I was like, like so sad because I'm like, you <sighs> fuckers are right. Ah. Like, the last time it was brought onto the consoles was like 3DS. No, I, was it? I believe yeah, you're so, right. What yes. about 3DS? New 3DS. Because I right, have right, right, it right, right. both on 3DS and uh, Wii U. Yeah, I have the Wii U, and they they brought over Beginnings, which was the the first one that they had made. But they I don't know why Nintendo oh. has done this so many times, where <laughs> they made game a game, <laughs> but they they had finished it so late at the point where it's like no one cared about the console or the new console was coming out, so they're just like ah, we'll just leave it. Yeah. Because they've done that with Earthbound, they did it with Star Fox, and then obviously Final Fantasy did it as well. They dropped Final Fantasy 2 because that one has a full on western localization the original one for the nes that had a localization or was it two or three i don't remember one of the two had an american uh, localization they dropped it because by the time the nes was done and so they're just like well, it fuck, might be we'll just move on three i think okay it was three i don't remember it's one of those two and that i heard and i was like what the hell why do companies do this so much back in the day like that was such a concurrent problem that they would just drop games like how metro dread technically was a game that could like would have never been if they didn't release it on switch because hell, even the developer was like, yeah, we're done. We don't know. Like, I, he couldn't accomplish his dream at the time. So he's like, I just will shelve it for now. Yeah. So if the Switch hadn't existed, probably would never would have gotten Metroid Dread. It would have stayed like a forever missing franchise, essentially. A missing game. That's what it sucked. Um, I mean, now we have it and we have remastered Prime. Emulators tend to keep stuff in a better state for newer players, in my opinion, compared to companies nowadays. Yeah. No, oh, no. For fucking sure. Um, well, absolutely. It, uh, like, that I, mean, is, I don't think anyone here could ever disagree with that. I mean, there's certain companies that I will agree with have done a, a, a decent job with some of their remasters and, like, porting jobs. Like, I know Konami, as much as I hate Konami and I give them all the crap in the world, which they fucking deserve. But, yeah, like, no, they do. Konami have done a decent job when it comes to their remasters or their older games, like Contra. Um, they've done, I think, Gradius and a couple of the other, like, arcade games and Castlevania. The their collections are fucking fantastic. They they're amazing. They're really well done. Like, you know, Balls to the Wall, they are an amazing ports and versions of those games. And how I'd say just buy those. They're cheap and they're really readily available. And sometimes it's better than emulators because of the features that they add. Yeah. I just... Um, there's some decisions companies make to not bring older games onto digital consoles, especially when they've done it for um, 
consoles in years past, like I'll never understand that reason not to. Yeah, I don't. I will never understand either. But I want shit it like good no Silent sense. Hill ports. Oh my gosh, Silent Hill. Yeah. Um, I'm not looking forward to the remake of two, but the new one, Silent Hill M, I actually am looking forward to. It actually looks like it's gonna be pretty good. Actually, great. Ironically enough, is um, what was it? Uh, Symphony. Uh, not Symphony of the Night. What the fuck? Symphony of the uh, Night. Tales of Symphony. Yeah. The Switch version. Holy crap! I've been playing that and it is rough. Oh yeah, I. Tales games are like, like rough. Like uh, the port's rough, or the game itself. No, the port is rough. Really? And what's worse? Yeah, no, the Symphony one is bad. It like I was literally playing it, and in some points where there's literally only two characters and a bunch of sand, the sand areas. <laughs> Like, I can feel the console chugging. I see the screen tear. It's bad. That is surprising, because the Tales games aren't necessarily that, like, powerful. Intensive. No, exactly. That's That was my thing, because wow. I, I have Vesperia, which was the first one to come out on Switch before they made Symphonia's remaster. Yeah. And that one runs like a dream. It's amazing. It runs beautifully. I seriously could not believe, because this was a newer game on the 360, but I was like, holy crap, it runs amazingly, and the graphics are even better than those. So I was like, holy shit, this is amazing. So it made me really sad when I saw Symphonia's remaster, and I was like, God, that is atrocious. It's, like, borderline unfinished. And funny enough, Bandai obviously saw all the tweets, and they're like, yeah, we'll fix it. We'll, we'll attempt to fix it. And I'm like, thank God they at least had the common decency to be like, fuck it, we'll fix it. Because there's a lot of companies who'd be like, we're done. We're, we're not fixing this remaster, and they'll leave it broken. Yeah. <coughs> Squeenix. <coughs> Sorry, what? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I think I may have just become apathetic since I'd never heard of the remakes or am. Okay, so Silent Hill 2 Remake, I I lost hope in it when I first saw the fact that the camera is going to be over the shoulder. As opposed to fixed angle like it has been forever in all Silent Hill games. Um, and then also seeing James, how they made him look like... I, he just looks very too uncanny valley in my opinion. Silent Hill M looks good, however. It's going to be taking place in 1960s Japan, if I recall correctly. Oh, really? Um, Yeah, so I'm kind of looking forward to that. Uh, especially since that's it's the cool. first Silent Hill game that's not going to be in a Western location. Like, I was surprised to see that, but I'm here for it. Um, you living? I am not living for the Silent Hill 2 remake, though. I, the, Why they made the executive decision of over-the-shoulder camera is just you will never like... Understand. Yeah, like, this isn't fucking Resident Evil. It's Silent Hill. Come on. I guess because they saw the Resident Evil, they're like, Oga Bunga, let's do the same thing. Yeah. So, hopefully they won't pull that shit with M, but who knows. It's it's Konami. We really... It's a real crapshoot of, like, whether or not it's a good port, it's a good version or a bad version. I mean, it's, think of it like this. It's a... Mm. It's the same company that gave us the remasters, but also gave us Contra Rogue Corp. Yeah. Just saying. Like, <laughs> we've had some shit things come out of them, so it's like... It's a complete crapshoot whether or not it's going to be good. Yeah, honestly. I I did just take a look at the time, and I know you were pushing our... Yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I will probably start dipping out. Uh, they haven't messaged me just yet, so I will... I can give it, like, mm, like 10 more minutes, and then I'll fucking put it in, and then we move on. I will move on. I was about to say, well, did you yeah, need to, like, get set up for it or something? Uh, not really. I already have it set up for the most part. It's going to take me, like literally no time ah, just cool. a couple of switches here and there so yeah i can i can still continue so talking what i'm hearing is i am not allowed to just uh force rate it to you and we all sit here and watch you entertain us <laughs> dance monkey dance oh no <laughs> yeah we sit here and make you yeah we're watching streamer uh coco oh, do you want to watch no. megan uh i don't know honestly maybe i've maybe. i've heard some things about megan it's it's, it's interesting from whatever May maybe maybe Maybe. Maybe. My guys. I am I I am undecided, but perhaps You're undecided. A little bit. Oh wait, oh that does remind me, there's one other thing I forgot to mention. That what? we might be doing Dokapon, maybe together. Dokapon. Oh yeah, I forgot yeah. the Dokapon game. Yeah, when's that supposed to be yeah, coming out again? We talk, I thought I did, literally I remember DMing you being like, Hey, do you and I was like I realized out of context it sounds really weird. It's like, hey, do you have you want to get the Dokapon game? It's like, what the fuck? Why are you talking about me about it? What the fuck? <laughs> Yeah, no. I'm trying to remember, is that going to be on Switch or is that Steam? It is going to be on Switch. It's, Switch. Uh, I think, if my memory serves, it's in, like, not May. It's in June. I think it's, like, June-ish. Let's see. Or May. Mm, let me double check. Yeah, Dokapon Kingdom Switch. Let's see. Uh, It's going to be dropping... Oh, that was the initial release for the game. Okay, we want the Switch port. When's I think the Switch it is June because out? there's three games in, like, June for me, and I'm like, I'm fucked. Because that summer is going to be hell for me because 
essentially that would be a total of like what five games coming June up? June 30th. Games up? Yep. Well, okay. Uh, do we count September as summer? Do we are we counting September as summer? Uh, or are we counting it more in like? Did fall? you just say are we counting September as summer? Be, no. The reason I ask is because. A game is releasing in September, and it said it was being released in the summer. And I was like, I guess it's getting counted as I'm summer. So no. I I'm oh, okay, killing Riker. Right. You know, Peggy, it. Peggy, you're, go on. That, that's that's very called for and justified. After, that con after what we just heard, I think that's very justified. Wait, what? <laughs> He's like, I'm killing Riker. Well, no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm not saying it is. I'm not saying I'm classifying it as summer. I am not saying this. This is what the release date is. I'm like, I guess that's classified as summer now? September is not classified as summer. Like, I just kind of looked at it and I was like, what the fuck? Like, I, th I thought this was autumn. Aug what? August oh. is like the end of summer. Oh, hello there, Excite. What are you doing, baby? Um, but yeah, no, so that means like I have five games in total that, that summer. So it's like, it's going to be hellish for me to just kind of get through. But just play I'm them not all really the counting time. Pokemon as one. Huh? Just play them all at the same time. Easy. Jesus. You want me to play the new freaking what's it called? The new detective game from the creator of uh, Dongan Rampa. Yeah. The uh, uh, Dokoban Kingdom, Loop Eight, great looking RPG. Highly recommend it. Looks great. Um, Baton Kratos One and Two, and then Ghost Trick, the freaking Capcom DS game. Like Jesus Christ. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying for you to do. God, and especially after like a month buff after. Tears of a Kingdom comes out, which God only knows how long that's going to take <laughs> me to go through. Tears of a Kingdom, I forgot that was one. Oh, uh, yeah, them having to cancel that game. announcement was ring. so time. <laughs> like, so I have time for that, but like, holy crap, bro. It's like, I have two months of nothing, and then two months of like, holy shit, everything's happening. Uh, so literally, that, that's, a, that's a periodic school semester schedule. Yeah. Quite literally, so that's gonna be interesting. So yeah, so I guess we'll be doing Dokopon together. So that's gonna be interesting to see yep. our friendship die in that moment. Yes, uh, I probably wouldn't be able to stream it because I have a switch light, but maybe, I don't know. Maybe. Well, I mean, I think some people have hacked it enough so you can actually stream from it, but I, I can't raise my hand. I don't know. Dad, are you telling me you want me to go? That why you're getting all. It's, it's like, hey, yo, feed me, mom. Feed me, mother. Feed me. I crave. Yeah, so I might actually have to call it here myself. I might throw it over. All right. To you, yeah, though. I gotta call it here. I just got hit up. Yeah, let's I, do it. I'm, I'm gonna cut. All right. Well, I'm gonna be throwing it over to you. Big surprise. Um. So I'll see you in a few minutes. <laughs> surprise! Surprise! Oh, I can't oh, surprise! Oh, surprise! Oh. Surprise! Surprise! But thank you, Riker, for streaming with me. Sorry we started late, but I still appreciate it nonetheless, dude. Oh no, no, no! It's fine. I think we both started late because when you texted me, I was also waking up. So hey, like, you, yeah, we're getting that head start on the uh, the Pokemon uh, sleep thing. I know, right? We're getting we're a real getting head start on that one. Start. And I remember I was literally like, oh shit, I gotta take a shower, I gotta do all these things. And then, you know, I was stressing out, and you're like, no, that's fine. And I was like, no, no, I wanna get this done now. Like, bro, it's all good. Ah! Ah! Stress, <laughs> tiny stress. But I, you go set up for your thing. I'll, I'll catch you in a bit, homie. All right, take care. Bye bye. Being awesome. I'll see you next time, Coco. Bye boy. Bye boy. All right, guys. So I'm gonna OMG be Coco's live. Coco's always late. Uh, yeah, Coco's live, but unfortunately, Coco's getting ready to end stream. <laughs> when I need Coco around, uh, I tell her two hours <laughs> earlier than the actual time. Okay, I mean you're not, you're not wrong. Um, depending on what it is, I will be very late to it, but yes. Um, but we're gonna call it here. We're gonna go raid Riker. So, um, thank you guys so much for everything today, for all of the raids. But more importantly, thank you guys so much for spending time with me, just because that's one thing you can never get back. Um, I will be back tomorrow, maybe. Um, I'm gonna try to get back into solo streaming. Um, I get you're not late to work. I mean, uh, sometimes I am a little bit. But also, I'm a student worker, and my schedule is just more of, like, a minimum hours per week required, instead of a time. Um... But yeah, I'm gonna try to do a solo stream tomorrow since I haven't ripped Pangy Sundays. Pangy, I cannot be playing a game with you every fucking Sunday. I'm sorry. I'm going to get burnt out. <laughs> I'm gonna get burnt out, my guy. <laughs> I will try to stream maybe Cult of the Lamb. Maybe. Hopefully. 
If not, maybe we'll just play Final Fantasy and talk. I don't know. I know, I'm taxing. <laughs> You're taxing. Don't tax me. I have no money. I already have to pay the IRS. I still have to file my taxes. <laughs> but yeah, guys. No. Um. Uh. No, that not that tax. Oh, thank you. I don't pay my taxes. Taxing on you. Ah, uh, you're taxing on me. Ah, uh, gotcha. They haven't caught me yet. I, but yeah, so hopefully there'll be something tomorrow. If not, Twitter and Discord are going to be your best bets for, like, announcements if I'm joking with stream. Um, or not if I'm joking with stream, if I'm canceling stream. <laughs> I'll file it before the absolute uh, last minute, Pangy. It'll probably be filed in April. You know, I'm here for that. <laughs> But yeah, um, also check out YouTube for the VODs. I have to go download these two videos and then put them together with video editor. Coco takes 15 minutes to do your YouTube. No, it takes me like 30. It takes me way more than 15 minutes. I file mine, uh, solo. <laughs> Alright, there's some tax evasion comments going on in chat. I am not getting people. Uh, in trouble, so SMH Mark Raid, or if you're a subscriber, you can do SMH Mark Sub Raid. Uh, we're gonna go throw this to Riker. Hopefully, there'll be something tomorrow. Um, hopefully. I'm gonna try. I will try my best. Because I haven't actually... I, I checked my YouTube VODs channel. I have not done a solo stream since August. Um, but we will try our best to get something tomorrow. Um... Oh yeah, I should probably like actually type in Riker's name to this. That might be uh, helpful. Oh, he's doing a Terraria stream. All right, yeah, we're definitely um, raiding him. If you guys want to see Riker die a lot, because yes, it happens. <laughs> um, but yes, guys, thank you so much for everything. I will see you tomorrow, hopefully. But until then, I hope you have a great rest of your Saturday, a good start to your Sunday. I love you all very, 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 very much. And stay buttery, my friends. Now let's go show Riker some love, shall we? Bye-bye!